you need to talk to me so bad? So let's go back. No, I don't want to go back. You know that clapbacks have an expiration date. Destiny and Sean. Oh my goodness. Sean getting a woman in prison is very shocking, to be honest. I didn't know how serious it was going to get because I'm, I'm Italian. I will. I don't back down. I'm little, but I'm feisty. Yeah, we've heard that word feisty. And Sean was like, she's feisty, she's feisty. I think they should meet. How? This woman sits down, Kelly sits down, and the first thing Sean says, okay, Kelly, this is Destiny, Destiny, this is Kelly. I like the order he did that in, okay? Put some respect on her name, okay, on Kelly's name, for carrying your six kids. That thing still bugs me out, though. It bugs me out because it's crazy. But anyway, and then the minute she sits down, it's like, right. Anyway, I'm here to say that we need to set some boundaries. And you cannot just be calling me any time of the day like that. What? Just like that. So he starts off. He's really trying to show that he's that. That he's that guy. That That's what he's trying to show. You have to get a hold of this. It's an absolute emergency. That's one thing. But other than that, that's you know, like, not the way it works. Why would you go after some guy that has a bunch of kids that he has why to take care of? Which one is why not? Why she went for this guy that has six kids and knew that he had the sick? Well, actually, no. In the beginning, he thought he had two. I think he only mentioned two. See, this is why you already know that this guy. <laughs> which of the four kids were you denying, my my guy? Which of the four years he also he lied about his age. He said he was like 30 something. That's like 45. So yeah, I don't know. When people start lying like that, and that's why Destiny was quite upset because that's not a good thing to start off a relationship with. But you denied some of your kids, and she as a result of that, or <laughs> this is just who she is, and I think it's the latter, but it could be the two combined, also doesn't care. If you don't care, she's not gonna care. Money's flowing in, she's doing great. Yes, what? We clash. What is clash? We clash. Hey, this one has clash. We clash. We clash. Ah, she too has clash. They both have clash. Oh, maybe that is why they are the video. Anyway. The way he's talking to Kelly, Kelly, stop it. Like he would a kid or one of his kids. Why did she do that? We're actually getting married. We're actually getting married. Destiny, that is not a comeback. Somebody tells you stuff you don't want to hear, and then you just say something that's gonna just crush their souls. And yet you say you have clash. <laughs> I don't think so but anyway that that was just so low it's so low so so low and sean is just there he's just gonna sit there he doesn't care he's just gonna whatever makes destiny happy he's gonna roll with it it's incredible look at her face look at her face she's like hmm, you getting what now you married you getting what after all these years they said off and on for 20 years yes because that's how long you'd have to be together to pop out six kids 20 years off and on for 20 years and this man never thought to beg this woman to be his woman for life because she was just a baby making machine for him i don't know actually well because i had no intention of being around i'll still be the out of i'll still be the out of you what 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 kind of comeback is that what is that going to do in the situation so you're going to beat this and then what like people that are this age and that talk this way and that think this way disgusting like why for what reason ridiculous <laughs> why are you getting up and getting all in her face dude come down you just gotta have to stop you know as far as you know talking all the time every day on the phone yeah you never had a problem with that before with your other girlfriends have you? Huh? he 
put her, she definitely put him on blast. Like, you never had a problem with that with your other girlfriends. I'm sure Destiny's like, what? Which other girlfriends? I thought it was her and me. Yeah. If she made your bed, now lay in it. That's the thing. He's already made his choice. He's so clear with his words. He's not missing it for his words, even though his words are coming out of his mouth. Rather difficult, but uh, with, with difficulty, but he is saying what Destiny wants to hear. And that's like, I don't want any contact with you. And she's like, oh, well, then you're not going to have any contact with your kids. And he seems to be fine with that because he's going along with all that. He's choosing this one over his kids. And then they're gone. This guy is something else. You had to have a clap back ready that you didn't have, and now you're talking about let's go back. Is that not ridiculous? You yourself sitting there, you don't think this sounds ridiculous. What do you mean, let's go back? Imagine, eh? Sometimes you want to have a clap back so bad, but then you really don't know even what to say, and then you walk away, and then you're like, you know what? You know that clap backs have an expiration date. You can't just, you can't just walk away. And five minutes have passed and you're like, got it. I thought of a very good thing to say. Let me, let me just go back. Let me just go back real quick. The thing that you said five minutes ago, you remember when you said, and then you said, you don't remember, you don't remember. You just said that that's not how you said it. So how did you say it? But then my clapback doesn't fit the thing that they're saying that they said now. That's not how I remember them saying. That's not what you said. In any case, this is what I have to say. I'm clapping back to the thing that I thought I heard five minutes ago. That's not how clapbacks work. So Sean, you with your whole 48 or 45 year old self, I don't know what you're thinking. That would be so weak, so embarrassing to go back in there and be like, and you know, another thing, like how childish is that? Mm -mm. Oh, we're gonna change my number. We're gonna do what it said and when- We're gonna do what said, okay. And, and I swear to God on my grandma, Rachel. Hey, don't swear on anybody's grave wall. They will come to get you. If there is anything that anything, and I start feeling some type of way, dude, and something's not right, and okay. it starts getting like that, dude, we're just gonna end it. I don't care if we're married three months. I don't care. So That's a threat. That's a threat. She's like, I don't care if we're married three months. I don't care. So he's now going to be like, oh my gosh, even if we're married one month, two months, three months, six months, a year, five years, this woman can still just leave me. Yeah. And the way she's spazzing out is even so funny because wasn't she in a store trying to holler at a woman? And she was like, I don't care, I'm still gonna do what I do. So I always think it's so incredibly incredible when these people have the guts to actually come at somebody else when they're doing so many things, they have so many skeletons in their closet. Ridiculous. So I'm glad you held yourself back. I know you're holding yourself Just back. Be quiet, please. <laughs> <laughs> Here goes Sean again waffling. Like he's doing too much. It's like people in high school when you're trying to like they're trying to like give compliments and they're overdoing it. Will you be my girl? I like you. I can't be without you. You're this, you're that, you're this, you're that, you're this. That's Sean. All day every day, all he wants to do is just compliment this woman. Can't you just talk normal talk? You don't always have to be like you're this, you're that, you're this, you're that, you're my queen, you're my goddess, this and that. Like we know that you worship this woman. We can tell. She's got you, uh, what's that song? I got you under my skin. Something like that. But, yeah, it's not normal. You know, it's never been a problem when you've had your other little girlfriends. Like, to me, that means that this has been an ongoing thing. They've always talked, so, I mean, I'm sure that there's probably other things that I don't know about. She's not coming anywhere near my kids, and that's just it. And she wants to get crazy me talking to me, dude. Like, for real, like, I will beat the out of her, dude. I know you would. That wouldn't even blame you if you did. I'd bail you out. I'm so mad at you. I wouldn't even blame you if you did. I would bail you out. What the heck are you saying right now? You want this woman, this random, random woman that you don't know from anywhere. You want her to go and beat up your ex. That's not just your ex. That's your six kids. You want her to go and beat her up so that your six kids are going to have who to take care of them? And you would back her up? You would bail her out? 
if she did that. In fact, I wish a chick would because she would go right back to jail. All this big mouth in life for what? This is what ends these people back in jail. Just these small little things that, that would irk somebody. For them, it's like World War III. For them, it's like something like the world is ending. For them, it's like such a disrespect. For them, it's like they just... And so that's why, what programs do they give these people? What do they do to make sure that these people not only not do anymore, but are also not violent, know how to keep their emotions in check, know, get some anger management, like, wild. I don't understand. Like, I don't, I don't, like, I don't I understand that. what? I don't understand why you would do Listen, that. Can I talk, please? Hey, so he has a backbone. Wow. The making good. Think about it. Because I'm sick of hearing your care about none of the that you give me. Like, I don't care about that. You see, I told you, when he talks, he's not very convincing, he's not very smooth with it, we're not very fast with it, sometimes it doesn't even make too much sense, like, nobody wants that, nobody wants to hear that, like, mm -mm, this stuff is getting old, like, you're talking, like, it's not convincing, whatever. I care about the person that you are, like, I have integrity, Sean. Hi. Sean heard about me going back to prison. I'm just expecting the worst, it's hard to just figure out my feelings because I'm not used to working with my emotions and my feelings. I'm used to just getting high and running. So to like sit here and talk about it is frustrating for me. Oh. You see? This is why they need to get these people like the real emotional help that they need because this is what's going on with her. She is thinking that she'll go back to prison maybe seven years. Is that what they said? Something like that. And he'll be like, okay, then let me just go back to Kelly. And by the time she comes out, he's long forgotten about her. Some of his kids are dating, getting married, going to university and all that. And he's all kinds of ingrained in their lives. And he won't be there for her anymore. But she's also out here keeping her options open. Oh gosh, I hate that ever since Quaylen and Chevelle. But yeah, she's also out here keeping her options open, flirting with people, like flirting with that girl in that furniture store and stuff like that. So she's no saint either. So, hmm. The whole thing is crazy but anyway i've been rambling about these people for way too long the whole thing is crazy the disrespect is mad be careful who you you know who you decide to 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 not only spread the legs for but also decide to eh, you know have your womb use your womb basically use it as a baby making factory then you pow 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 six of them out and then he can just start acting anyway because i'm sure that kelly is also depending on him financially because he used to send her money as well and this is like that needs to stop too ridiculous because i don't know how she wants these children to survive but she don't care and you've made it that she can be with you and not care that's the scary part but anyway if you're not already part of the family make sure you hit thumbs down and don't that subscribe button comment because i really want to know what you think like because you obviously like this video and hit the notification bell i shared it i'll see you in the next video which will be tomorrow daily videos up in here daily video gang gang so yeah in the meantime make time for glorious life it's time to start what let me try it god bless mm -hmm.